Good morning, guys. Um, I'm trying to be a little quiet. So I've been trying to do something new in the mornings. Like I mentioned in my vlog, um, probably a couple vlogs ago, I was talking about how it was really hard for me to do anything with Grayson right next to me and how I feel like I need to create a little more independence from him and a little separation from him. He's hearing me talk. So I've started a new thing where in the mornings, I used to bring Grayson in my bedroom with me and he would just follow me around, get into all sorts of trouble in my room. It was hard to get ready, whatever. I've done a new thing where I've now put him, I have a gate set up so he can go into either his room or his other playroom in the guest room. And I just shut the gate, I leave my door open so he can see me as I pass through the door. But I'm trying to create a little bit of separation in the mornings and to show him like, it's okay to be away from me. It's okay to have time away from each other. I know he's safe, he's not gonna hurt himself. And it's really hard on him. The past couple days, he's just been standing by the gate crying the whole time. Today, he cried for a good bit and then he actually went to go play with his toys. But then once I started recording this vlog, now he's crying again. So I'm trying to create a little bit of distance from him. It's kind of hard because I'm a stay-at-home mom, so he always has access to me. But I need to create a little bit of, of boundaries at certain times. I don't feel like, you know, I'm asking for a lot. I just want to get ready by myself for like five, ten minutes. And, he, you know, I know he's safe. He's He can't get into trouble. So this is what we're working on, and I'll show you. <laughs> This is usually what he does. He just stands at the gate and cries. Go play with your toys! All done! You go play with your toys? So it's a work in progress, but that's our new routine that we're working on. Grace was very mad because Felix was just sitting on my lap and he wanted to sit on my lap and so he did not want... Felix on my lap anymore, but I was telling him he needs to be gentle. This is going to be tough when we have another baby. He is not going to want to share me. He won't even leave me alone for 10 minutes. Oh, don't touch the camera. Ah, uh, no, no. No, no, no. He knows when it goes pop, he goes pop. And get that out of the toaster. That's right, pop. Okay, let's go eat them. Go to the family room. just put them down and then he usually comes and takes them. Mmm. Oh, yep. Ah. Waffles. Ah. Mm-hmm. Waffles. Um. Take that one. Good job. Good job. Pat your head. Oh, rub your tummy. Rub your tummy. <laughs> Jumping on the bed, he fell off and bumped his head. 
So we just got back from story time at the library. Grayson loved it, it was super fun. It was packed, there were so many kids there. Um, but it was good, we sang some songs, read a couple books. He's not really into the book thing, which I get it. He likes the songs though. And um, I forget what we were doing singing a song and you had to pat your head and he was actually starting to pat his head like he's starting to actually like like um like do the movements along with the song so it's really really fun to see him interact with the songs now and like participate in story time so now we're back we just finished lunch and i think greg got most of it on himself i put a bib on him and he ripped it off so I think we're not really going anywhere today. Yesterday I said, oh, maybe we'll go to Hobby Lobby or we'll go to the Splash Pad, and we didn't do either. We just stayed inside because I'm tired of the hot. So I don't know what we're gonna do today. We will see. But Gray's reading is, is that your dinosaur book? Never touch a dinosaur. Like giant bony plates. Yeah, are you gonna open it? You must never touch a dinosaur with spines along its back. Oh, you must never touch a dinosaur with horns upon its head. You must never touch a dinosaur with sharp and pointy claws. Yeah, is that a dinosaur? Rawr, that's right. Yeah, you must never touch a dinosaur with giant bony plates. Oh, yeah, don't touch that dinosaur. Oh, yeah, don't touch that one. Oh, don't touch the dinosaur. Ah, oh, you're touching it. No. You must never touch a dinosaur with sharp and pointy claws. Just go and hide somewhere inside and please lock all the doors. I see you. <laughs> I love you. Can you go get the ball? <coughs> Getting all his energy out by having him run. He's just running back and forth. Hi. I see you. <laughs>
all of their Christmas decorations out. Oh my goodness. Great, look, is that Santa? stuff i can't look at it though like it's too soon too soon yeah santa like looks so much wow yeah santa this is the place to be now looking out there's halloween decorations wow grayson's saying ho ho he's looking for santa <laughs> Scary? Scary. Ghost. He's saying boo. Ghost. So we're back. We went to Hobby Lobby and then Target. I wasn't impressed with Hobby Lobby. I saw somewhere that their clearance was like 90% off, but I couldn't even find their clearance and what little clearance I found, it was like party supplies and stuff. Like nothing that I wanted. Sorry, Grayson's trying to get the camera. So I, hang on, I gotta stand up. So I wasn't impressed and I did find a sign that I, cause I wanted to put something on top of my refrigerator. So I found a little sign that says thankful. <laughs> And then I also found a sign for our dining room back there where Grayson eats because we have nothing on the walls. So I did find that. Um, and then Target, we just looked at like the Halloween stuff, but I didn't find anything. I was kind of disappointed in both stores, but whatever. I still have to figure out what I'm going to have Grayson be for Halloween. I don't know. There's so many choices. See, there's so many choices. So I gotta give him a bath and then I'm gonna put him down. But yeah, thanks for hanging out with us today. Sorry it was kind of boring, but it's 93 right now. And so I was like, well, we could go to the splash pad, but it's just not worth it, I don't think. So I decided not to, and I decided to go shopping instead. And I had more fun. And Grayson was loving the Santas at Hobby Lobby. So cute. And then we went to Target and we were in the Halloween section and he was like, ho, ho, ho. I'm like, yeah, you're not gonna find Santa here. So, it's so funny because he's not scared of, like, the scary things yet. He actually is intrigued by them and likes looking at all the spooky ghosts and stuff. So, super cute to watch. But, yeah, that was kind of our day, and now it's the weekend. So, I'm just waiting on Anthony to come home from work, which hopefully will be soon because I miss him. And Grayson's just going to play. Felix has sat on my lap. Okay, sorry. The clip ended abruptly because Anthony called me on his way home. But, yes. Signing off for today. Grayson's about to go to sleep. He needs it. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Say bye. You say bye-bye? Bye. Bye-bye. This one video to show Grayson begging to go to sleep. Grayson, are you sleepy? Do you want to go? distracted by Felix. Ah. Grayson, are you sleepy? <laughs> Do you want to go na night? <clears throat> Do you want milk? <clears throat> yeah, he loves it. Come on, let's go get your, let's go get your milk. Come on. He's always just excited to go to bed.